I am making my sheet pan ratatouille pizza, which is loaded with fresh, sweet veggies and burrata and roasted garlic. It is delightful. To make my dough, I'll just combine all my ingredients into my stand mixer bowl, two cups of bread flour, one and three quarters of a cup of whole wheat flour, one and a half tablespoons of sugar, two and a quarter teaspoons of instant yeast will help the dough rise, one and a half teaspoons of kosher salt, and that's it for my dry ingredients. I'll whisk everything together. I've got my water here. This is one and a half cups of warm water. The warm water helps the yeast do its job. And then three tablespoons of olive oil will make the dough nice and soft. I'll give this a little mix just to bring the dough together. Okay, I'll let this knead for seven to 10 minutes until it's smooth and still slightly sticky. This is looking good. I'll grab a clean bowl. Drizzle in some olive oil so it doesn't stick. Scrape this in. Turn it over so that the dough gets totally coated in the oil. I don't want it to dry out. I'll cover it in my towel and then let this rise until it's doubled in size about one to two hours. My dough is poofed and fluffy and ready to shape. I've got my sheet pan here that's coated with a generous amount of olive oil. Don't hold back with the olive oil. It makes the crust a little bit crispy and kind of fried on the bottom and really good. And then pat it out. I'm stretching this dough all the way to the edge. This looks good. I'll cover this up now and give it one more little rise while I prep my ratatouille veggies. I've got a garden of veggies prepped and ready to go on my pizza. I've sliced them and salted them and given them some time to drain and get the moisture out because I don't want any excess moisture weighing down my pie. My dough is puffy and ready to be topped. I'll start by drizzling on an herb-infused garlic oil. It's gonna be like secret flavor. So people will be like, where's all that flavor coming from? I'm also gonna fish out some of these garlic cloves to smash onto the crust because that just sounds really good. I'll spread on some red sauce. And I just like a little bit of sauce with this. I want these ratatouille veggies to be the star of the show. I'll spread this all around. All oh, these smells are really good. Look at all these fun colors. I'm just gonna arrange them totally randomly. And they can overlap a little bit. Ratatouille is a French dish, and it includes so many of the veggies that I grow in my garden every summer. And when they're at their peak of freshness, they're so sweet. So I love them on a pizza. And I've got thyme and rosemary. The earthiness of these herbs complement these veggies really nicely. Now I need the cheese, of course. I've got burrata, which is gonna just cover these veggies in creamy goodness. I'll just tear this right over. I'll finish with a little bit more oil. This will help the veggies brown. It'll make them glossy and party ready too. Okay, I'll bake it now at 450 degrees for about 25 minutes until it's folded. Yes, I am so excited about this. So to finish this off, I'll sprinkle it with some Parmesan for that boost of flavor. A little bit of flaky salt to make everything just pop. Some fresh arugula for a peppery crunch. And some nice greenery on top. And lastly, fresh basil. How pretty is this? Yum.